Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I would film something that I don't really film too often on my channel and that is a clothing haul. Now, I recently came across the brand called L-O-T-D. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's this brand here. This is one right here. And I went on and when I was online they had 50% off all of their clothing. So I grabbed a few little bits to show you guys as I wanted to test how great the quality was and things like that because if it's good quality most of these products I bought were like £5 each. So I'm hoping that it is good as there's a few bits in there that I'm really really excited for. There are a few bits, I can't actually remember what I bought so it was just a surprise to you as it is to me as it was like a week or so ago that I actually went online and bought this. Also there is a dress that I bought for a fiver which I'm hoping I can wear to a wedding that I'm going to in like three weeks time but it has to go on quality and if it looks good or not because if it looks quite cheap then I'm definitely not going to be wearing it so I'm nervous and excited at the exact same time now if you haven't already please remember to hit that subscribe button and to give this video a thumbs up also and without further ado I'm just going to jump straight into this video okay so where do I open it? Okay, open it up here. This is a haul but it's also going to be me trying on them as well and tell you my honest opinions on each product which I haven't done before. So hope this goes well, I really do as I'm actually using natural lighting right now and maybe in like half an hour or so it's going to get dark I think. So I'm hoping, praying that this is going to work as I'm too lazy to go upstairs and get my light. So, the first item that I have, I'm going to grab, is a top. Now, I'll give you the price as well, just while I'm here. This top was... What did it do? Oh, it doesn't even say. That's handy. Okay, I think this top was about £5. But I will leave everything that I bought in the description box below so you guys can have a little look. Now I am wanting to change up my style as I got rid of a lot of clothes and I think primarily this bag is tops or jumpers as it's what I don't have a lot of or if I do have a lot of they're more for like lounging about and not going out. So this is the top here. Now quality wise it feels amazing. It's this top here. It's like a wrap top that is cropped and I love like the frill detail along with like, the bottom it's really really pretty and it's also got frills on the sleeves as well so I'm hoping this looks nice on and it isn't too low cut as I have literally got no boobage whatsoever so I might need to put like a pin there or something to keep it up but hoping this will turn out okay as I really didn't know what the sizing was like, so I kind of should maybe went to a size 8, but I got a size 10 in this. So hoping it's true to its size. I have never found a top in my life that does not sit around here. I've literally got no boobs, it may look like I do, but it's got a good brown. And I just love it, I love the sleeves, I love how they're really floaty. And it just kind of pulls in all the right places. I don't have like, the most flat stomach, but I'm working on it and... I was buying tops like this, so I could go out and feel confident in like a pair of jeans, like heavy jeans and a top like this and go out and just feel super super confident and I feel confident in this top so it's a massive thumbs up from me. Next I got this jumper. As you can tell I'm loving the colour like mustard at the moment, it's very in this season and I'm also just, I like how it looks on me. So this. I think was also five pound in pretty sure. They're like maybe like five ten pound, but it was still like in like an affordable price range. Now this, I was so confused what the about the sizing is. I always tend to go for a size small, but it says on the website a ten was a medium, so I was like we're right. So hoping this fits. It does look quite cropped, 
but I mean I can work with that. I don't think it's meant to be cropped but I think I can probably work with it being cropped. But I didn't want to buy it like a large and then it just be too big and like, kind of draw me out. So I'm very small. So this is it here. It's just knitted and pulls in at the sleeves as well. So I'm excited to give this a try on. But I love this. It is such a perfect fit. It is like quite cropped. I wouldn't say it's very long. But I mean if I tuck it in like this, which I usually do with my jumpers anyway, it looks perfect. I love it. The sleeves are maybe like a little long, but it's kind of what I like about jumpers. I like when they like kind of look very like shabby chic almost. I absolutely love this so much and I have so many outfit ideas to post on Instagram things for this. So yes, another massive thumbs up from me. I have... What is this? I don't know. I feel like I would not have picked this colour. But we'll see. Oh yeah I have. Okay, okay. So this top was actually the top I was very unsure about. And I mailed two of my best friends being like, will this suit me? Is this nice? Can't tell. This was definitely five pound. As I was like, but it's a fiver, so I can't really go wrong with a fiver. So this is it here. It is kind of like a duck egg blue and it is just kind of like this goes like straight up and down but the sleeves are long and they are frills. No. It doesn't look the best in person. The quality feels amazing, like there's nothing wrong with the quality at all. But I just don't know if this is going to suit me or not as... I don't know, I think I can suit quite cool things but I'm not a cool person so I don't know if I'm going to pull this off. But we'll see. Okay, so this is the duck egg blue top. I'm not too sure. I feel kind of silly in it, but I think it's because I'm not used to sleeves like this. But I do love it. Apart from it's like quite tight on here and it gathers up here. I kind of keep pulling it down all the time. Because it's kind of gathers up. I think it might just be the bra that I'm wearing. And yeah, I'm not too sure. I don't know if I love it or I hate it. But please let me know in the comments below what you think as I'd love to hear them. Next is this here. What is this? Oh, this is a t-shirt. This was maybe £5 as well. And it was just International Women's Day when I bought this. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy this. Is when I seen this top, I had so many outfits in my head when I seen this. And it was just kind of like this tucked into jeans, like high waist jeans or a skirt and kind of like roll up the sleeves like this, if you get what I mean, like roll up like that. But it's this top and it's just got girls, girls, girls all down the middle. It's just very plain, very simple, but I love a good slogan tee and this, it just, just feels like a normal, a normal t-shirt. It doesn't feel thick, doesn't feel too thin, it just kind of feels like just right. So yeah, I'm excited to give this a go. I'm hoping that the print doesn't fade too quickly, but I don't think it will. Okay, so this is the t-shirt. I love this t-shirt so much. It fits lovely. The quality just feels like it's not, definitely not worth £5. And I love the slogan. It's definitely what I expect it to look like in my mind. So it's a very good thing. And I'm 100% going to be keeping this, and I love it so much. Lastly, I've only bought five things. Because I was wanting to test the waters on this website, but... I am in love with everything so far. And it is this dress for the wedding I'm going to. Now I'm hoping, praying, that this does not look cheap. I've already burst the bag, so I'm hoping it fits and looks nice. But this was £5 and I'm really struggling to find a dress at the moment that is going to look nice in April the wedding. So it's kind of, what's on my hair? So it's kind of going into that like season of, can we kind of come out with dark colours into kind of more springy, summery colours. But it is, where's the back? That's the back. So it's this dress here. Now it wraps just across the boobage -boo area again. I'm hoping that fits me and doesn't like, like, Go right down low so you can see everything. And it's kind of got like three quarter length sleeves by the looks of it. I think it was long sleeves on the model. But I think, yeah, they're definitely not going to be long on me. 
and on the way down it has a slit at the bottom here. I'm not doing a very good job of showing you this. Um, yeah, it's got a slit just at the, at the, the side it looks like here as well. I'm hoping this looks nice. I do like the design of it and I do like the colour. The quality, it's really, really thick. I was scared it was going to feel quite like cottony and just feel like I'm wearing something like a t-shirt which I really wasn't wanting but no this feels really fitted so I'm excited to try this on. Okay so this is the dress. I really love this. It's so fitting. It's not loose here at all so I don't feel like I'm going to be having to do like that if I do wear this to the wedding. So it feels really fitted. The sleeves are kind of maybe just a bit too short for me like as you can see but if I just kind of like wrinkle up like that it doesn't look too bad I don't think. Um, the bottom, it's very risky at the bottom. Um, I feel like if I do that, which I'm hoping I won't be doing, but it's very like very high at the pant area. So I'm hoping that it looks alright, but I really like it. So that is everything that I ordered. I really hope you guys like what I ordered and like this type of video. Everything that I have bought, I will be keeping. But I'm just totally unsure about that duck egg blue top. I don't know why, I thought it was going to be like a different material. But I'm going to work with it. I'm going to try different ideas and see what works. And hopefully it won't look as silly as what I feel in it as... I just don't know, I'm not too sure. But as I said, leave your um, suggestions on that top down below as I'd love to hear them. So thank you very much for watching this video and please remember to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button as I said at the start of this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!